Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be a different kind of video. It's actually for a competition called NCRC that I enrolled for. The challenge was to make an app, a shopping app that makes shopping easier in the COVID-19 crisis. So don't forget to share this video to all your friends and family since one like equals one vote. Let's get the most likes ever. I'm Saket from SP Robotics, Maker Lab, Vanasthiri Puram. And today I'm going to show you my shopping app that I made for the NCRC Senior Robotics Challenge. Every like is one word, so don't forget to like this video since that will really help me. And also, thank you to Sterling Holidays, Fun City, and all the other sponsors that are helping SP Robotics conduct this NCRC competition. So now, I'm going to show you how my app works. So, now I'm going to show you the shopping part of my app. So, for you to go shopping, you have to click on this shopping cart icon. When you click on it, it asks you to stay safe from COVID-19. And it tells you to check if you meet the requirements of all the checkboxes. If you do not check any checkbox, then it tells you that you are not safe from COVID-19. This is actually true because you need to wear a mask, carry hand sanitizer and wear gloves or else you are prone to COVID-19. Only if you check all three check boxes, it lets you proceed to the next screen. So now I am going to show you the shopkeeper part of my app. So, all you have to do is click on the shopkeeper button. Here, you can scan a QR code. After you scan the QR code, you, you can add the name of the item and the price of the item. And then click on add item to shop to add it to your shop. All of this gets saved in a database. So when you open it again for the customer to buy it, then the items won't get lost. So the shopkeeper only needs to add the items once to his shop. After that, it will be saved in the database. Uh, oh, I added a bed instead of bread in my shop. So, all my customers will be confused where to find a bed when what I wanted to add was bread. At this time, the clear all button comes in very handy. So, all you have to do is click on the clear all button. Then, it opens a new screen where you can add all the products. So, now I'm going to add all the products again. So now I have added all the items to my shop. So now I am going to show you the customer part of my screen. So first you have to click on the customer button. Then you can scan QR code of the items that you want to buy. So we added milk for 30 rupees in the shopkeeper screen. And now that got carried over to the customer screen because of the database that we added. It also calculates the total amount for you 
because sometimes when you calculate it in your brain there can be some time some types of errors so after you added all the things that you want to buy what you can do is show this to the shopkeeper and pay him the money and take it home the shopkeeper won't even need to calculate the amount because the app already shows the total amount on the top of the screen now i will show you more apps that i made using coding that i learned from sp robotics so when you click on the more apps button you can see speakly whiteboard and photo editor in speakly you can type any word hi and the app will speak it for you this can be mainly used for people who have trouble speaking or cannot speak at all this is inspired by the machine stephen hawking used to use to talk now i'll show you the whiteboard in the whiteboard you can draw anything that you want you can doodle some random stuff anything pretty much and this can also be used to teach children in an online class and in the photo editor you can take a picture pick an image and after you edit it you can share the image you can clear the doodling or the editing that you do on your picture if you don't like it you can also change the color of the pen etc etc there is also a eraser and a list for the width of the line so those are the other apps that i made using coding from sp robotics now i'm going to show the interesting youtube and instagram buttons in my app when you click on the youtube button you get teleported to my channel here you can see all my videos and subscribe to my channel when you click on the instagram button you can see my instagram like my post and follow me now i will show you how you can get information regarding covid 19 when you open the screen you can see different buttons if you click on the m o h f w button it takes you to the ministry of health and family welfare website which is run by the government of india and here you can see all the things regarding covid 19 and other things as well you can also install the arogya setu app which helps you to see covid 19 cases near you if you click on the who button it takes you to the world health organization website of covid 19 here you can see universal updates about covid 19 when you click on the preventive measures button it shows you some preventive measures against covid-19 this was issued by who so it is something that you can trust you should not trust any other things that are not issued by either ministry of health and family welfare or world health organization these are the official organizations that are helping india fight against covid-19 If you click on about the developer button then you will get my information If you click on this button you get teleported to my YouTube channel 
If you click on this, you get teleported to my Instagram. Now, I'm going to show you some fun games that you can play in my app when you are bored from shopping. So, I made three games. Football, Space Invaders and a snake game. So, first, let me show you how football works. So, in football, you can flick the ball and hit it off the walls of your phone to score a goal. If the goalkeeper catches your ball, the game is finished and it displays your score. Now, I will show you Space Invaders. So you can place the rocket and hit the button. When you fire it, it makes a funny pew noise that is supposed to make your friends laugh. See, you win! Thanks for saving the planet! Yay, let's go! Because you won against the aliens. And Snake, which is a game that I developed completely on my own. You get score for eating food by driving the snake around. But if you hit the edge of your phone, then you die because the snake rammed into a wall. It is a very fun game. So guys, I hope that you liked my shopping app that I made for the NCRC challenge. And again, every like is one word. So share this to all of your friends and family and make sure that they like the video because that will help me to qualify for the next round of this competition. See you later guys. That's it for today. Bye bye.